What's going on YouTube? This is your boy The Vintage Man back with another video and today we're gonna be talking about five sneakers every guy should own in this collection. I've been wanting to do this video for a while now, maybe going on for like two months, but now I have every single shoe that I've been having in my mind that maybe every guy should own in his collection man but before we get into this video man right now if you are new to the channel i need you guys to subscribe right now man we're so close to 30,000 subscribers man we're gonna do a big huge giveaway at 30,000 subscribers man so the faster we get there the faster you guys can get the details about what your boy the vintage is going to be giving away to the vintage game and make sure you hit the notification bell for your boys so you never miss another video that drops on the channel or live stream i tend to go live every saturday and sunday so if that's something you don't want to miss man make sure you hit the notification bell right now and if you're watching this video man make sure you smash that like button and go for every video is 300 likes but for this one right here man we want to get this to five 100 likes man i know you guys have been waiting on this video but like i told y'all man i finally have every single shoe i feel like every guy should own this collection so i'm very excited to drop this video for you guys and head over to ig give your boy a follow at the vintage world the link will be in the description box below so with all that being said let's jump right into the five most essential sneakers every guy should own in his collection man let's get it so like I said, guys, we got five pairs of shoes. I feel like are very essential for every guy to own. You're gonna get right to the first one as you see on top and get straight to it. So as you guys do remember, I did an unboxing straight from the go app maybe two weeks ago, and I picked up the Ian Connor Revenge Storms. I really thought they were Vans. I think on YouTube, a lot of people called this just Vans, so I just went along with it because they pretty much took the whole idea of a Vans sneaker and then made it into their own, man. So let's get right into these Ian Connor Revenge Storms right here. I got the black and white color colorway right here. I know they have a blue colorway, they have a red colorway. I think it's a couple other colorways that Ian Connor Revenge Storms made. But I feel like this black and white one right here pretty much goes with anything. So if you're not like a flashy guy, if you're a guy that don't have a lot of clothes in the wardrobe, you wanna throw just on a basic white tee right here as you see I got on. You can throw these junks on with pretty much any color jeans and you'd be set to go with your everyday life man so check it out check it out the revenge storm ian connor aka vans knockoff right here as you can see and i guess you could call these vans just a more hyped up type of van and me personally i don't know how it's not like a lawsuit against you know what i'm saying ian connor with these shoes right here because as you can see they look exactly like a pair of vans man so right now in the comment section below i want you guys to let me know if you have these in the collection let me know if you have a pair of vans but this right here to me is one of the most essential sneakers for every guy to own that you can wear with anything, man. Along with the other four shoes I will be showing you guys today, you can wear them with anything. So now that I showed you guys the first shoe, the Ian Connor Revenge Storms, we're gonna go straight into a quick on feet over these joints, man. So let's get right to it, man. Alright guys, so for the next pair of sneakers, I feel like every guy should have in the wardrobe, in the collection right here, as you can see, we have an OG Red Show 11 box right here. And as you can see, we have the Bread 11s, man. This is shoe right here I feel like everybody should have just because one, you can dress up with the shoe, you can dress down with the shoe, casual, dress up whatever way you want to spin this shoe off. It's a very dope colorway. It's pretty much basic as you can see, man. All upper is black. You got small hits of red right here at the jump man and you have an all red outsole but for me this is probably one of my favorite air jordan 11s but the simple colors allows you to wear this shoe with a lot of things a lot of different color of jeans a lot of different shirts like i said if you're one of those guys that only have like the white tee the black tee because that's how i used to be a couple of years ago you can throw these shoes on and have some fresh kicks on your feet man so right here as you can see air jordan 11 bridge you guys let me know right now how you feel about this and while we're going along with this video you can comment down below some of your most essential kicks that you have in your collection some of the shoes you wear a lot down below please if you do not mind yeah man check it out check it out this is the 2019 bread 11 i have the 2012 version as you guys do know if you've been following along with the channel i had tripled up on these bread 11s man that just pretty much shows you guys that i really like this shoe and you can wear this shoe with a lot of things so now that i showed you guys the second shoe that every guy should have in a collection we're gonna jump right into a quick on feet portion over these shoes man let's get it And you go, I 
I was just letting you know I know the weather is cold, but you on your own I ain't no regular Joe, you should've left me alone I'm in the zone, I'm where the predators roam We are the Senate in Rome, and I'm on the throne This ain't no regular poem, this ain't that regular tone, no Do you follow me, baby? Can you see what I have? Do you like what you see? Do I follow your path? All right, guys, so as you can see, we have an Air Jordan 1 box, and this is pretty much a category, man. The Air Jordan 1 is very essential. You can get any colorway. As you guys can see over there, I might have like 30 plus Air Jordan 1s in the collection. That's because I wear those shoes a lot, man. That's another shoe just like the Bread 11, man. You can dress up in the Jordan 1. I feel like you can even dress down casual-wise, and it's a very dope shoe to have all year long, summertime, wintertime. It's a very durable shoe. And the different colorways that Jordan brand brings out, man, you can pretty much wear this Air Jordan 1 or any Air Jordan 1s with any clothes you have in the wardrobe. Like I told you guys about the first shoe that I showed you guys, the Revenge Storm Ian Connors. A couple years back, all I did wear was pretty much an all white shirt, an all black shirt, but I always had some fresh kicks, man. And that's a shoe, a pair of Vans that I had a while back. I just beat them up very bad, so I had to throw them away. So I had to spice it up and get some of these Revenge Storm Ian Connors. But I really thought it was a collaboration with Vans, man. So like I said, these right here, you can get any colorway of the Air Jordan ones, and it can pretty much go with anything in your collection. Prime example, man, like the metallic pack of these Air Jordan ones, you got an all white base with like a different color swoosh, and that gives you a wide variety of stuff to wear with that sneaker. But these right here, man, I only brought them out because this is one of my favorite Air Jordan ones, and I haven't thrown them on feet in a while, man. So, like I said, you guys let me know right now if you feel like every guy should own a pair of Air Jordan ones. I like getting a lot of engagement with the subscribers so we can go back and forth in the comments and so I can see how you guys are feeling. See, so yeah, man, a pair of Air Jordan ones are very essential for every guy to own so let's get right into a quick on feet over these shoes man let's get it guys know I had to do it I feel like right now in 2020 if you don't have a pair of Yeezys you're probably not that big into sneakers but this shoe right here that I'm about to pull out man the creams right here what can you not wear with a pair of creams you feel me this is pretty much like an all-white Air Force One you guys know that that shoe is like the most sold sneaker with Nike but these creams right here like I said same with the mm -hmm. all-white Air Force Ones that was another shoe I was thinking about throwing in this top five shoes every guy should own. I was like, man, why not throw the Yeez in there? Give you guys a little bit of inspiration on switching up from the Air Force One. So I know a lot of people have at least one pair, if not two, because that shoe goes with everything. But this all white pair of cream Yeezy 350 V2s goes with anything, any pair of jeans, any shirt you wanna wear. It's an all white sneaker and it's very versatile. And the huge reason I put these above the Air Force Ones is because the comfortability of this shoe. I feel like forces are very uncomfortable and if you wear that shoe a couple of times, you get a big, huge crease. You start to mess up the outsole and you got to get a whole nother pair, man. But these right here, you can beat up. I wore this shoe the whole time while I was in Berlin, about three days. I wore them every single day. Very comfortable. One with every single one of my outfits. And it's just a dope shoe, man. So right now in the comment section below, let me know if you have a pair of all white creams. We're going to jump right into the own feet over these all white cream Yeezys, man. Let's get it. Alright, so for the last shoe, I had to switch it up. I had to show you guys these shoes. I had three pairs of the Converse Calmar Desch Garçons. As you guys do know, when I was overseas in Germany, a store up there called Museum had pretty much every single colorway, the hot tops, the low tops. And I was only able to grab three because I didn't find the store until I was about to leave back to the States, man. I was so upset. But they had pretty much every single CDG that released they had in the store. And man, I must say that I'm missing out. But let's get to this shoe real quick. Like I said, I have three pair of these 
but the one that I like the most, the one I rock the most, you can tell by when you see it on feet, it's pretty dirty, is these all cream white Chuck Taylor CDG collaboration sneakers, man. These are very fire. You got the hearts across the shoe. The shoe is very classic, and I've really loved how CDG collabed with Chuck Taylor and gave it a nice spinoff. They gave us the hearts all over and just make the shoe pops 10 times more. If you're one of those OG type of guys and you want to get a swag, a little bit of spice, man, go ahead and grab a pair of CDGs. You get them on GoDap. I know they have some on StockX. And check some overseas retailer stores. I know pretty much every single one of them have the Chuck Taylor CDG collab. I wore this shoe a lot just because, like I said, it's all cream white. You can wear it with anything. You go check out my Instagram. I have a couple pictures in these shoes right here. And you know most shoes that you have in your collection you throw with a fit. It's like a hit or miss. But this shoe right here, every single time is a hit, man. I promise you guys, go out there and get you a pair of Chuck Taylors. You don't have to get the CDGs, but if you want to spice up the swag a little bit, spice up the charisma, go ahead and grab you a pair of these CDG Chuck Taylors, man. So, with all that being said, let's jump right into the on feet portion over these joints, man. Let's get it. All right, I appreciate every single body that tuned into this video. Make sure you smash that like button right now. Every single like counts, and the more likes we get, it's gonna spread throughout YouTube so you guys can check out some of the most essential sneakers to have in your collection, man. Subscribe if you have not subscribed already to the channel. Ring notification bell for your boy so you never miss another video that drops on the channel. Head over to IG, give your boy a follow at Dimensions World. It'll be linked down below in the description box. I appreciate all the love and support, and with all that being said, I'm gonna catch you guys in the next video, man. Peace.